I have registration work. Okay. So I have to call him. Hi, ma'am. Hi. How are you? Yeah, I am fine, ma'am. How about you? I am good, thank you. How was your weekend? Yeah, it's very busy. Uh, my child have uh, holidays. Uh, because okay. of rain, rain. My child the... is on holidays. Okay, is on holidays. So yeah. yeah, I am busy with my child. Good, that's nice. I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> so what are you doing today? How was your day today so far? Today, um, today I have session. That's why I am a little bit. I have watch verbs. Verbs. Yeah, vocabulary. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Do you read fictional stories also? No. Uh, stories just um. What's the meaning of uh? You said what name? That's name. Fictional what? stories. Fictional. Fictional is me. Fictional is something that is. You know, not real. We create stories and then we like novels, story books. Do you read that? Okay, yeah, but I don't read in book. I uh, watch videos in YouTube. Try reading books also. This will help you a lot with vocabulary words, sentence yeah. structure, and grammar because it's written na, so it's easy to focus and remember. Hmm. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Listening and watching can will take time to remember, but reading will always be there with you. Yeah. Okay, ma'am. So try that out and see. Okay. Do you uh, tell any books names? Just. Mm -hmm. uh... Okay. I'll give you a story book first. You try with the okay. story book and see. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Please check your chat. Yeah. The Enchanted Wood by Enid Blyton. Enid Blyton is actually an author who writes for children. Oh. She okay. writes, she used to write only for children. Okay. That book, it's gone. Name is uh, name was gone. Name is gone. No, no. Open the chat, uh, the chat box. Na? Open that. Click on that. Chart. Yeah, yes, ma'am. The yeah. enchanted wood. Yes, ma'am. Yes. I wrote. Right. So yes. she used to write only for children. So children like six years and above can easily read. Okay. Try it. This is British English, but I know you will learn a lot of vocabulary words. Yeah, okay, ma'am. Thank you. Right. Try that. This is easy. You learn a lot of vocabulary words, sentence structures from here. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. I'd okay. like. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're welcome. Okay. So, what are your plans for today? Today, plans are um, after session. Uh, I have um, many, but... Um, I have to call um, for a uh, uh, plot. Uh, means uh, I have registration work. Okay. So I have to call him, and um, and I. You so, bought a plot, or you're selling a plot? No, I already actually my dad bought it. Uh, I didn't. Uh, he they are uh, didn't registration. Okay, they didn't do the registration. They didn't do registration. So, okay. yeah, uh, now I'm, uh, I have work, that work. All right. So, mm. you've told a plot. Mm. Uh, yeah, yeah, plot. All right, all right. Okay. Oh, fine. That's good. Yeah. So how do you spend your time when you're free? Mm, um, Hypothetically, let's say I know your daughter is also busy. Everyone, now you're free. What will you do? How will you spend it? 
I am homemaker, ma'am. So yeah. I do works. I do chores in at my home. Yeah. Um, when I was free, uh, I watch. When I am free. When I am free, uh, I watch animated stories, and um, I am watching another course videos actually in YouTube. This is okay. related I to. Okay. I watch. Ah, uh-huh. I watch another other other course videos also. Other videos. course other videos course also other videos other course videos course videos hmm. uh, also uh, yeah i am spending time like that okay so what do you like watching like what other courses do you watch uh, that is related to um, job uh, software field which field sorry software field ma'am software oh, field software it field. it field yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Okay. But uh, okay. I don't have basic knowledge on that. My husband encouraged me. That's why I'm watching videos. Yeah. Good. So what are you watching? Python, uh, Java. What are you learning? No, this is a chip design. Chip design. Yeah, that is this is hardware related to hardware. Yeah. Okay. So how will yeah, that help you? Um. This is uh, chip is in everywhere. Uh. Nowadays. uh it's um uh in cars and um uh, every every software i think in um, television uh the chip uh, we if we upload the chip uh it will do automatically i think the works um yeah so yeah i know only but the chip is nowadays using everywhere Uh, it is being used everywhere it's being yeah it is being uh, programming i think code coding related it code. is used it is used in programming code programming code programming yeah yeah all right okay good good it's very it's very, good. It's very yeah. difficult ma'am but uh, yeah i am trying yeah but you chosen something very difficult I yeah. thought you probably were studying some language like Python. Python, I heard that in the basic one is slightly easy, so you can try that. Yeah, because uh, I my husband is in ha- that field. That's why I am uh, trying to the. I am trying this uh, software. Yeah, that's the Python. These are all software field. I know it's yeah. very little easy, um, but I have to take coaching, and um, if I have any doubts, no one will tell. Uh, no one Correct. will support to me no one will support me support me hmm. yeah that's why i am learning this okay all right yeah. so what are your future plans what do you want to do i want to do um this uh, related to this job if what i am preparing what i am uh, learning now uh, even uh, if it's continuously i do i if i have time I want to do this job. The chip Later. designing and all. Yeah. Hmm. Try it out. All the best. Yeah. Thank you. It should work out. <laughs> yeah, it have do many many uh, so much hard work. Yes, you have. You can say I have to work hard a lot. I have to work hard a lot. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah yes, ma'am. Did you go through the session notes today? Mm, yeah, yeah, yes, ma'am. Uh, Did you read the situation? Time. Did you read the situation? The bizarre surprise. Yeah, I, I yeah, I read, ma'am. I read situation bizarre okay. surprise, bizarre yeah. surprise. Mm. Do you want to try that and see? Yeah, yes, ma'am. Okay, I'll read the situation again. Okay. Yeah. Then we okay. can do the questions. But remember one thing: whenever you have to answer the questions, don't start impromptu. Yeah. So you've heard the situation. I've asked you the question. Take some time to think. Yes. And plan your answer. Okay. okay. Yes. You are hiking in a forest, and you find a black suitcase. Inside it, there is ten crores in cash, and a piece of paper stained in blood, with a single word. Don't. Who would you tell? Who would you tell? Um, 
i wouldn't like to tell anyone ma'am because uh, it's a uh, risky situation i think so yeah i wouldn't like to tell anyone um if um what next yeah yeah i'll i sprint that place i sprint from that place i will I, sprint i will sprint from that place yeah i don't want any risk involved in my life yeah okay involved in my life okay right. yeah okay that uh, if uh, when i saw that uh, blood i think when i saw that uh, blood paper with on that blood with paper when i made i saw the paper in blood when i saw that paper in, in blood. blood so i may feel i definitely i feel tension um, i i will get tensed i will get tensed 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 t e n n e d tensed tensed i will yes. will after will it see you but the if i see the paper in blood i will get tensed okay this is the correct sentence okay ma'am if i uh, see the paper I in have blood one doubt. i will get tensed Yes. Uh, in future tense uh, we use will after verb one right this is tense t e n s e d yes we use past tense means this is verb two right it is the main verb tense is not the main verb oh okay i will get after will yeah. the main verb will always come and the main okay. verb is always in infinitive format yeah okay that is the rule so i okay. will get tensed tense yeah okay i will get tense yeah that's why uh i will i i will spread from that place yeah would you take the suitcase home or leave it and why i wouldn't take a suitcase to home <laughs> because i wouldn't take the suitcase home to home yeah home not used to okay with the word home and especially your own home you will never use any preposition okay only with the word home okay. and if it is your home that is the rule okay i am going home i am coming from home yeah yes ma'am i am home i went home yesterday you are talking about your home so nothing will come for yeah. anybody else's home you will use preposition if you are talking about your house yeah i am going to my house there you will use preposition plus pronoun okay i am coming from my house i will go to my house but the word home and if it is your home will not take any preposition okay we use the to only house to Just and pronoun to. will come with house yeah we don't use to in like any situation house. yeah okay ma'am yeah thank you you're welcome so now try explaining it and give the reason why also ah uh, yeah why I means 10 crore rupees you can take it leave the paper <laughs> Bec uh, no actually uh, if, when i saw that uh, uh, suitcase if i take uh, to i will take take home uh, that suitcase i will take it home i will take it home i will take it home uh, that suitcase uh, it's uh, risky i think because uh, police or uh, who belongs to that suitcase they will who investigate that suitcase belong to who does who does that suitcase belong to or to who? whom does that suitcase belong whom does that belongs okay or who does to whom to whom does that suitcase belong who does that to belong whom? to okay. whom does that suitcase belong okay it's easy to who does belongs to the suitcase who 
who does that suitcase belong to belongs to belong belong to belong okay belong okay yeah who does that suitcase belong to ha huh. uh, so that person uh, will find me uh, definitely so yeah i don't want to put uh, uh, my life in risky situation mm, so yeah that's why i do so that's why i wouldn't um, uh, go with that suitcase i wouldn't take that suitcase i wouldn't take the suitcase yeah. yeah okay and then avoid the usage of the phrase so yeah so yeah because you're using it as a filler word okay okay avoid that usage not required okay ma'am okay hypothetical situation they're asking again if you take it home what will you do with it if i take 10 crores means huge amount 10 crores is so yeah if i take um, i will buy um, home uh, car these are all uh, my husband uh, i know uh, my husband knows share marketing i invest on share marketing i will uh, invest in share markets nothing marketing there is nothing a share marketing my husband yeah. knows and my husband understands the share market i will tell my husband to invest in it okay i will tell my husband to invest it in yeah. it in it hmm. Hmm. yeah okay okay uh, <laughs> so uh, after um, this is so much amount so yeah um, so this is a huge amount huge amount uh, i i will i will give to i will give this amount to orphanages orphanages is correct orphanages 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 I and uh, when you have when you talk about orphanages we don't say give we say okay. donate i will donate donate amount to different orphanages okay yeah okay i will i will donate amount to di- to different orphanages yeah and um, uh and i'll give amount uh, to my parents um i will yeah. give some amount to my parents to my parents so yeah i'll spend like that okay so you will yeah. spend all money or you will keep some in the saving also um i invest in shares so that's the saving okay yeah. i will invest in shares so that will be my saving yeah yes i will invest in shares that will yeah. be saving amount uh, that will be our saving amount our saving amount okay okay good yeah i have one uh, doubt ma'am grammar is uh, um, what is the how to practice uh, step by step grammar if Please i step. if i practice only grammar uh, i don't speak english because um, we uh, i am not practicing speaking english that's why speaking Correct. is the important uh, so while i'm speaking english i did many mistakes uh, grammar so yeah how to practice uh, grammar uh, you have to speak and learn like this it's easy then the other part in case if you want to do something extra there's a cambridge book intermediate english grammar it's blue in color okay intermediate english grammar it's intermediate. a cambridge book uh, the name of the author is raymond murphy okay ma'am raymond r a y m o n d yes raymond m u r p h y okay raymond murphy mm. okay okay so then you get this book it's a blue colored book on flipkart easily available not very expensive you can okay. practice whenever you're free okay okay it's well explainable 
Okay. But otherwise, there's no shortcut. You have to speak and learn like this. You have to remember with the corrections. So either you start writing it down, as okay. in when you keep getting corrected, or then later on go through the recording and then note it down when you are free. Okay. But without that, it still will not help you. This is the easy way. This is the only easiest way to pick up right now. Yeah. Some of the mistakes. Try and remember the corrections and don't forget. So consciously make sure at least one or two corrections you should remember to continuously use it in your speaking so that it stays in your mind. Okay, ma'am. Okay, you'll have to okay. try one one thing at a time, but it has to go like that. Okay. Okay, right? Yeah. Hmm. Okay, let's try some more. But these are all we know about. Uh, just you corrected me. We used uh, two only. No uh, house, not home. Yeah. Yeah. These are all how uh, in grammar we know all about these are all. This comes with practice also, and some of it I remember because this is my language. So okay. even I do my own analysis that when do I use it and when do I not use it. So any book will not explain you in detail like this, but because I know, I I do I have done my own analysis, so I know where do we use and where do we don't. So that is why I, ex okay. I explained it to you comfortably. Okay, ma'am. Yeah. A lot of English grammar books will not give you the exceptions in detail. They'll give you some exceptions, but not all of it, because English grammar is vast. You cannot touch every aspect and point. You have to learn by speaking, by reading. That is why I gave you books to read, story books. This is the easiest okay. way for you to pick it up. There is no other shortcut and easy way, except okay. this. Okay, I'm uh, I'm reading. Uh, uh, I'm watching English stories uh, while I'm watching videos. The uh, formation sentence formation is. Um, it is easy to uh, I I thought, but while I'm speaking, I I'm not uh, formatting sentence properly. I'm not forming. Forming, yeah, forming I'm not sentence forming properly. sentences properly. Hmm. Because it's a lack of exposure. Nothing else. Today you start speaking in English twenty four hours. So every day you speak in English morning to night. You know you will notice a change in two weeks. Okay. Not only will you start getting fluent, but you'll also start feeling confident because you're doing it twenty four hours. Yes, you are talking with everyone in English. Okay, ma'am. Then it'll become easy for you. Okay. Right now, it is only for limited period. After this, you have no one else to talk to in English. Yes, maximum you can talk to is with your child. That's all. Yeah, I'm trying. Uh... My husband is also. He is also telling me you speak uh, every time. Uh, you speak every word, every sentence in English, uh, to with my child. Um, yeah, do it with her and also ask him to help you yeah. out. In the sense okay. that at least you talk to him and he should also reply in English. It's a matter yes. of few months, but do it. Both of you do it together with your child. Also, you do it when you're free. She will also learn. You will also learn. Yes, okay. Ma how old is she? Uh, he actually not. Uh, Sorry, he. How he's old a boy. Is uh, yeah. he's four and a half years now. Don't worry. Then try it with him right now. This is the best age. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay, ma'am. Okay. Do it okay. with him. When the time comes, this story book you can then later on start reading it out. You will have okay. to wait till he turns six, six and a half years old. Then start story books of this author only. You put him into this reading. Okay. For four and a half years old, also you get story books to read. Okay. Bedtime stories and all. Search for bedtime stories for four and a half, five years old children. You'll okay. get it. Put him into that reading part. You have to read with him. He won't do it alone. So one page every day you do it with him. For you, you will read only two pages, not more than that. Only two pages every day you read for yourself. Okay. I don't want you to. Stress in this and take tension. It won't help you. You will take a lot of time then. Okay. Only two pages every day you have to read. Okay. 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 Yes. Yeah. Okay. So try that out. Okay. 
he is uh, my son he is interested in on bedtime stories now he is watching yeah he is watching in tv uh, it will it will also i am also watching uh, hmm. it will it is also helping helping me yeah yeah he is uh, sorry he watches on tv watches he is watching is that he is doing something right now it's not a present continuous tense you are giving me general information so okay. stick to only pre simple present tense he watches okay. on tv on tv yes yeah. okay okay so try it out this way this will help you out you get some nice bedtime story books also so that he he gets into the habit of holding the book and reading it's okay. a very good habit it will always help him forever okay. if this is how he'll become imaginative creative which will help him later on in life for you also it will help you a lot okay. so you read only two pages every day okay okay once you know you start getting used to the language you'll understand then this will help you out more then you can increase from two pages to three pages that is okay but first okay. start with only two pages not more than two pages okay ma'am uh, ah yeah he's uh, he watches videos he watches on videos uh, in t on tv youtube on on youtube on youtube on youtube yeah, yeah. so uh, he's trying to um, he tries uh, tell stories he tries to tell stories yeah in uh, even i when night time actually i was night. yeah mm. sleeping when i when we are was sleeping at the time he's uh, he he tell stories he tell stories yeah yeah so you can say at the time of sleeping he tells okay. stories he tries to tell stories to me okay at the yeah. time of at the time of sleeping sleeping he, he tries to tell, tell stories story. ha tries to tell stories to me or he tries okay. to narrate stories to me okay narrate means narrate is like telling only but you always telling. narrate a story you don't say tell a story you always narrate a story okay yeah narrate yes ma'am n a r r a t e narrate a story Hmm. I wrote. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So try this out. This will help you a lot, Divya. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Right. Okay. You have a nice day. Take care. I'll meet you soon. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Yeah. Welcome.